Hey guys, today I want to come at you with, well, pretty much a Rite Aid and Walgreens haul. I did want to share one thing that I picked up from Walmart, but um, this whole trip started because I had a few of these Wet n Wild coupons. Um, and pretty much, to be honest with you, it kind of became a little bit of a headache. So um, pretty much... You know, all the drugstores have like wet and wild items on sale this week. So I'm going to just share with you some of the things that I picked up while I was out today. And like I said, they have their coupons out. You can try to use them, but for sure, like at Rite Aid, they're not scanning correctly. They're not being taken off and you have to get a manager and stuff. So to be honest with you, if you don't feel like dealing with the headache, I say don't even waste your time as far as the coupons go. But even without the coupons, the sales at the different drugstores are actually really good. Cause like I mentioned in my best beauty deals video, uh, CVS has wet and wild buy two, get the third one free. Um, Walgreens has Wet n Wild 25% off select items or 25% off and Rite Aid has Wet n Wild items 40% um, off. So, But I am going to quickly start at um, Walmart and pretty much um, I did pick up these one pair of lashes in Shutter Shock. These are the Wet n Wild eyelashes. Pretty much um, I was looking for the two pair that are um, usually about a dollar in all stores and that is the Shutter Shock ones and I could not find them that's why I picked them up at Walmart um, and I but what I did find a lot of is shredding the fringe and those are the ones I got from everywhere else I just I couldn't find the Shutter Shock nowhere um, so I did pick these up from Walmart these are 93 cents every day and this coupon, this 50 cent coupon, did work there with absolutely no issues. The scan right on through. So it did make these pair of lashes 43 cents. And like I said, the main reason I got these is because I could not pick, I couldn't find them at, you know, any other store I was looking for them at. So that's why I got them there. And to be honest, 43, 43 cents is not bad. For okay. These are good to have if you are like trying to improve your technique in putting on eyelashes whether you're just trying to be able to get them on quicker or if you are just trying to be able to get them on if you just don't wear lashes i do suggest picking these up because every day they're a dollar you know at most stores at drug stores and at walmart they're like a dollar so these are great to, like I said, just kind of practice with if you need to practice either being able to put on lashes or maybe just improve how long it takes you to put lashes on. And also these are really good also if you just want to try out different products and not, you know, ruin more expensive lashes and stuff for those people who like to use the more expensive lashes. You know, you can use it to test out different eyelash glues and mascaras and things like that without really having to go into, like I said, more expensive lashes if you happen to own like a bunch of the more expensive ones. You don't really have to, you know, end up, you know, using them up trying to just test out different, you know, glues, mascaras, things like that, or even like eyelash curlers, you know. These are good if you just want to test out other items and like I said, you know, if you don't want to use your more expensive lashes, that's really good for that. And I picked it up at Walmart. Next, on to Walgreens. This is what I got from Walgreens. Um, I did pick up the Wet n Wild and Rose Golden Goddess. Okay. Now, if you've seen most of my videos, if you've seen some of my other um, like tutorials and things like that, you know I absolutely love my... Wet n Wild Fergie Highlighter in Carnival in Rio. But before I ever got that, this is what really started me with highlighters. This, the Rose Golden Goddess. I absolutely love this, but it did break on me and it was all tore up. So I just ended up throwing it away. So I did repurchase this and yes, this is 25% off. And I'm so sorry, I did misplace my receipt from Walgreens. So I cannot tell you exactly how much it is. But, um... It was somewhere around three four dollars but like i said i apologize somehow i didn't lost the receipt for it 
I did pick up these volume vortex lashes um, just to give them a try because they're a pair I don't have and plus I really need darker lashes not necessarily longer lashes but just like darker ones so these are volume vortex and honestly I cannot find these you know in other stores that's the one thing about Walgreens. Walgreens has items at times you cannot find at another store. Like, I really couldn't find these in another store. It's very hard to find the Fergie Wet n Wild products. Definitely at drugstores like CVS or Rite Aid. Like, very, very hard to find. And Walgreens know what they're doing when they do that. They know it's hard to find. So, you got to go there to get it. Next is... Okay, and this is the Savvy. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right. But these are tweezers. And these are only like $2, which is not bad. And I just kind of wanted to give them a try. Plus, I needed some tweezers. So, I picked those up. And I did pick up these Carol Daughter Black Vanilla Leave-In Conditioner. I did have another one that I used up. You can see that's totally empty. But, um... I did want to point this out. When I purchased um, the first one, when the cashier scanned it, a dollar off coupon printed out. And she just took it and she just scanned it. So, um, these are regularly $2.99. And she scanned the coupon. So, the first one was $1.99. And then I went back to look down the aisle because I did try to find the bigger size because I like you see I already, I already had one and I really do like this conditioner this leave-in conditioner um but they didn't have it in a larger size they just you know have the small little trial travel size so I did pick up another one and when she scanned it I do have that receipt surprisingly but um when she scanned the second one as you can see, it had a $2 coupon that came out. I don't know how long that is going to last. I don't know exactly if it's for any and every Carol's Daughter product. But I do know when I picked this up, first a dollar coupon came out, then a $2 coupon came out. Which brought this down to $0.99. Cent, which, believe me, I'm not complaining because I absolutely love this leave-in conditioner. But I also want to say Carol's Daughter... At Walgreens throughout the month of August until like um, August 28th, I think. Carol's daughter is buy one, get one 50% off. So if you like Carol's daughter, you want to give it a try, you may want to get in on that sale of it being buy one, get one 50% off throughout the month of August. So definitely make sure, check that out. And it's not just Carol's daughter, it's a couple of items in the what they in the ethnic hair aisle that's like on sale throughout the month of august so if i um, if i get a chance to run back by there soon i will try to put up a more specific um list either on either i'll do a full video and they'll probably be up like later on next week or definitely check on instagram and i'll post it there um, just, you know, the different items that are on sale that's on a month-long sale at, um, Walgreens. But I definitely suggest checking Walgreens out. And on to Rite Aid right quick. Okay. I did pick up these Taming the Fringe eyelashes. I did go to a couple of, um, Rite Aids in my area. These are regularly... 99 cent but with the 40 percent off these are actually 59 cent so 59 cent for a pair of lashes is not bad at all it's actually a really really good price for eyelashes and like i said these are great to definitely try out different eyelash products you know if you want to use them without really just completely using up all your um more expensive lashes and things like that um, I did pick up these eyeliners, but these are not for me. I did pick these up for my mom, and these are, let me see, okay, yes, I have the receipt. The eyeliners are $1.79, they're regularly $2.99, but 
So $1.79 is not bad for eyeliners at all. And, oh, okay. Okay, uh, okay I'm going to go on to this. The Max Volume Mascara. You make one say, okay, here it is. It's $2.99. It's regularly $4.99, as you can see. Regularly $4.99, but this week they are this week they're $2.99, which is not bad. Okay, and this tame and define, like a these tame and define this product right here this is it protects lashes and you can use this as a eyebrow gel to keep your eyebrows together they are it it is originally $1.99 so it's on sale for $1.19 which is not bad at all it's definitely not bad for a brow and lash mascara $1.19 same deal with these brushes. They are regularly 99 cent with the 40% off. They are 59 cent and 59 cent is a really good price for makeup brushes. Just 59 cent is a really good price on makeup brushes. So I'm here for it. And that's what they look like. I just got two of the um, eyeshadow brushes. Because one, I can never have too many eyeshadow brushes. And last but certainly not least, I did get some blushes. And these were, let me show you how these were regularly $2.99 and on sale for $1.79, which I feel $1.79 for a blush is really good. And I've had um wet wild blushes before. They're really they are really good blushes. So show you the kinds I got. Um I got Heather Silk, Mellow Wine, Pearlescent Pink, and Berry Shimmer. Okay. Um, and pretty much, like I said, these were adult, they were they are a dollar seventy nine, which is a really good price for blushes. So this is my haul. Thank you so much for checking out this video. I definitely want to put it out because these sales and stuff are going on this week. So hopefully you can get in on them while they're going on. But also you can kind of keep some of the things that that are keep some of these things in mind in case well not even in case but for when um wet and wild goes back on sale for like 40 percent off or something so i definitely wanted to make sure that i got this out to you all uh, hopefully y'all can get in on some of these deals and some of these items thank you so much for checking out this video and i will see y'all in the next one bye